and I turn on the machine and set and suddenly bloop and I set it again and bloof and load but not the real unload just the motor just the uh, I forgot the name, the name is uh, servo tape servo motors turn it off so following the, the path signal because real servo on off okay came from this uh, this logic gate and uh, through by this 3.3 key resistors this is just to control the current the extra current it goes to from um, transport control to the capstan control here uh, real con okay no 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 capstan control here here but there is no nothing to nothing to to to, to guilt <laughs> to say the, this is causing a problem the problem is when the 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 gear the machine turn it on, turn on for like uh, five minutes the voltage has to be zero here when you press stop to arm the machine but in five or ten minutes the voltage begins to 2.5 volts and when when is 2.5 almost three volts the not the capstan control the first the real real control turn it off the the real servo motors and uh, that's this is uh dangerous because the, the the tape begins to it's a lot of mess here and the answer is recap 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 this is a 30 years old machine there is no recap and uh, just to to tell you about the i spent two days <laughs> clean up and um, searching for the path and everything but the answer is recap man i recap I changed the this 3.3 key resistor to drop the voltage by uh, to zero. It solved the problem, but I have to I need to do a recap and all the system, especially the five volts, and the five volts, these two capacitors, and all the the the, the PCB. So that's it. If you're having trouble with the MTR90 dropping up, the it's a recap. Sorry, sorry about that.